Hey guys, no one would ever believe that you put all of these DIYs together in under five minutes using Dollar Tree products. We had such a fun time making them. And the best news is they use things you probably already have at home too. I hope you guys enjoy. First, we're making sweater pumpkins. Every year, the Dollar Tree has droves of foam pumpkins. And you'll also need an old sweater. Give the pumpkins a really light coat of spray paint. This doesn't have to be super thorough. That's just so it doesn't show through the sweater. Stick your pumpkin inside and trim down. Once your pumpkin's inside, you'll probably want to trim a little bit more so you have as little excess fabric as possible. It should lay nicely over the pumpkin and you can secure with hot glue. To add some rustic glam, use hot glue to wrap jute twine around the stem of your pumpkin. And optional, add some Spanish moss to the top. But this is like quick, easy DIYs. Yeah. It's so easy. And if you have a child's old sweater or a sentimental sweater, this could very easily turn into a keepsake piece. It's a soft pumpkin. <laughs> Next, we're making a mini pumpkin patch because most people I know have some sort of tray or basket already at home. And I love the galvanized metal words. You get three for a dollar. We gave these a light coat of spray paint and this is the easiest craft. Take some Spanish moss and stick it inside whatever tray you have. And then any type of extra flowers you have. And one of my favorite Dollar Tree finds this year are the mini white pumpkins. Combine it with the sweater pumpkins. And if you wanted to use the reds and burnt oranges, you could totally incorporate those too, but I am loving the neutral look this year. Next is this super cute welcome sign we made in under five minutes. Take a scrap piece of wood that you have and one of those galvanized letters, you're gonna glue it on, and I love the mini pumpkins Dollar Tree carries this year. They're wooden and so cute. Put a pumpkin on for each member of your family. Optional is to add some dollar store jute twine to the end, just tie it on, and this looks so high end and you did it so fast. You couldn't get this for under $15, $20, and that would be with a coupon in sale. I would say full price, 30 to 40 I was just gonna easily. say, my, my, my gut was $34.99 yep. at Hobby Lobby. Next are these beautiful wicker bowls. I have seen these all over Pottery Barn and Hobby Lobby for 30 to 40 dollars. But the dollar spot at Target actually carries them for just three dollars, combined with some dollar store flowers and any type of plank board that you have. This one I purchased at the dollar spot at Target for five bucks. Combining this together, it looks so high end and it was done on such a small budget. Every woman I know is a pumpkin collector. You collect a bunch of fake pumpkins. If that describes you, you will love this next DIY. Take an old pumpkin. If you don't like the color of it, you can always spray paint it. And then get a Dollar Tree decal. They have tons that are perfect for Thanksgiving time. And these stick really well on the pumpkins. Because the pumpkin is rounded, you may have to trim it in a couple of places so it lies flush. But this looks so high end and was done for just a dollar. Leave a comment down below if you have any craft suggestions or things you'd like to see in the future and leave it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already so I can catch you in the next one. I can't wait for more DIY videos. I'm grateful for this community and if nobody has told you today, you are enough and I am so glad you're here. I will see you in the next video. Bye. It smells like mommy. Oh. Okay. You like that sweater?